Uh, hello, this is Studious Octopus, and I'm here doing the next Glossy Box unboxing. And this is the April 2015 UK edition. I'll just open it now. And this edition is supposed to be the uh, iconic Hollywood edition, it says here. And I think the top is supposed to be the same, which is Marilyn Monroe. And then you can get a different coloured bottom. Mine is kind of a minty green. And inside we have minty green colour as well. And it says, we all of us stars and we are all of us stars and we deserve to twinkle. Very cute. And there's a couple of cards on top. Got an advert for a clothing shop with a discount code. We've got our little editor's newsletter, which is we're paying homage to Hollywood Beauty. It basically says what we've got. And on the back we have another... Oh, sorry, this isn't a sneak peek. I thought it was a sneak peek. It's a guide to getting the Hollywood look using what you've got in the box. I'll just pop those aside as well. And then we have the little bit of what we've got. And yes, by the looks of it, you could get a blue one, a yellow one, an orange one, or the green one that I got there. And this is the top. And those are the contents there. So I'm just going to go through using the little card and do things in order. So first off is this Lord and Berry Lipstick Pencil in Kiss. And this is just a very red shade and I think everyone gets pretty much the same shade. And it says the perfect Marilyn Red. This modern take on a classic pillar box hue is ideal for spring. Unlike a usual lipstick, it's in pencil, making it even easier. And just says outline. And this is £10 usually. And it is 1.8 grams. And that's the pencil. So it's kind of chunkier than a normal lip pencil because it's supposed to be a lipstick. That's the tip. I'll do a little swatch as well. And yes, it's quite a vivid red. Very, very pigmented. But by the looks of it, you could also blend it out a little if you didn't want to wear it quite that red. And it's also matte. So that's that. Cute little pencil. It strikes me as something you could just put in your bag. Right, next off is... I think it's this thing. Yeah. This is Astral Original Face and Body Moisturiser. It's a versatile, rich moisturising cream that is a firm favourite amongst Hollywood stars and art makeup artists since its creation in the 50s. Just put it on your face. And this is £3.89 for 200 millilitres, which is not this size, so this is a sample size. So this is only 50 millilitres, so it's about a quarter of what that price is there. So this is worth slightly less than 50p, but I'll have the, the full price breakdown up there. So it comes safety sealed. This is the moisturiser there. It's a really, really thick, white, creamy type, and it has that kind of a strange, very old-fashioned, almost sort of talcum powdery type smell. But it looks like a really nice, very rich moisturiser. Probably about as good as Nivea Soft, which is what I like to use for my face. Because it says it's for your face. There we go. A nice little moisturiser sample. So I do like getting a combination of different things in these boxes. I'll just rub that in. Right, well, what's next? It's this. Ooh, that looks cool. Which is Pop Beauty's Kajal Eyeliner Pencil. Uh, 
that says an iconic cat eye is now even easier to recreate thanks to the Sudi Black pencil from Pop Beauty. So you can create a flicked wing and then blend it. And yes, so on the one side we've got the black pencil and on the other you have the little sort of squidgy blender brush, which I quite like when you get them in these styles because we've had sort of more expensive pencils from different brands and it always feels a bit silly when they don't come with the the little brushes to use on the end. So this is £6.50, this is full size and you get 9 grams. It's also safety sealed so you know no one else has used it or something weird. It's also awkward to open. So there's it's opened up. We've got the pencil end. And we've got the blender end. I'll just do a little swatch as well. So it's quite a black pencil but it does blend out really really easily. It's quite creamy, it's not very hard. Yeah. Oh, again a nice cute little more affordable looking brand because it's only six pound for a pencil that's not bad uh, next up is this item it's color club's belly their nail polish nude nails are a key trend this spring with roots in the hollywood era it's one of our favorite shades and it's complimentary for all skin tones and yes it says 1066 belly there I've actually heard of Colour Club. I think it's supposed to be a quite a good nail polish brand. It's one of those ones where it's not a premium brand. This is only £4.10. And you get quite a big container of it. But it doesn't actually, it doesn't say it. Yes, it says 15 millilitres. So like the Seattle one and the NCLA one last month, this is a bigger, more premium size one. I'll just do a little swatch on my nail. So this is it on this nail. Hopefully make that clear. And it's not hugely pigmented. It's quite a, a sort of a natural nude look. It does say on the little card to go for two coats once it's dried. Not sure how long it'll take to dry, we'll just have to see. But there we go. That's just a nude nail polish. Not sure if I would prefer this month to not have another nail polish since we got one just last month, but it's nice enough. And then last stuff we have IDC. Yeah, it's the IDC Institute's body lotion. This is in the scent Country Rose. This is following in the footsteps of our favourite Hollywood icons who loved the time to pamper and indulge in beautiful aromas of lavender or rose with this soothing body lotion. And this is full size and it is £3.59 for 100 millilitres, which this makes it full size. Just open it up and again it's safety sealed. I guess it just smells like a sort of a rosy body moisturizer. And it seems quite watery to the, the face moisturizer's creaminess, but I'm sure it's nice enough. So that's the whole box. And I'll just go away now and uh, work out how much my box is worth. Okay, I'm back and I've worked out how much the box is worth. So these contents here, which is, it's four full-sized items, which are three makeup and one beauty, and then the one sort of premium beauty sample. It actually comes to £24.68 and so far this has actually been my absolute cheapest glossy box that I've ever had. 
by a couple of pounds. The other one I think that was cheapest was there was one I had for £29. And I've had it for nearly a year now. So I don't quite know how I feel about that. Because it's like the the lotion feels a bit like something you might get out of a like a Christmas set of bundle that you bought from a just a a high street chemist. And I'm sure the, the face moisturizer is nice, but yeah, maybe this box is a little on the, the underwhelming side. I think out of it, the, the two makeup items are probably the nicest. And this, I think, is the most expensive item. The nail polish has dried now, and yes, it's quite a... It's on my thumb here. It is quite a subtle nude colour. You can barely see sort of what it looks like. So there's not actually much there, but... I have to see how it goes. So yes, that's the final box. Cheapest glossy box so far. A little underwhelmed, but it's not terrible. Uh, and that's it for now. Next box will be my 12th box. And then I might be doing a sort of a, what, what I feel after having had the glossy box for a year. So I'll see you again next time.